we're back. I know you guys want another video, and we got another video for you guys. So the next. Oh! Yeah! Oh! We're actually getting these questions from the comment section. Mm -hmm. So the more active you are writing those questions down, the more we're gonna give you. Make sense? The next question is, what is it like to be a step mom? Mm. Ooh, that is a good one. And I feel like a lot of she's people can. Damn good at it too. I feel like a lot of people can relate to this question. On the day, in the day and age we live in now? I'm gonna say it has its pros, a lot of its pros, and it also has its cons. But when you're maturing the relationship, the cons are like not there. What is it like? It's amazing. I'm gonna give the credit to the mom because they do a hell of a job, not even gonna lie, you know, with the whole raising their amazing two kids and they just make my life so much easier. But um, it's awesome. I just see them and it's like, it's, it just, we just kind of like just clicked, you know? It's like we have this special bond with each other that, you know, they just come into my room and they're just hanging in there and I'm like, what are you doing here? He's like, oh, because, you know, it's just cool to just be in the room and I'm like, okay, cool. But it's just like, we have like this cool dynamic between us, we call each other bro bros and bro broskies and it's just like cool. Like they really, you know, they have grown to love me without me having to like, tell them if that makes sense like i don't tell them like hey you know i'm your stepmother you should treat me like this or you should talk to me like this. like i've never even had a conversation like that with them but i guess like the way i treat them treat me the same way back and it's just like with so much love and pureness and i've seen the relationship grown between us since we first met because i remember for example the near which is our little one he used to be really really shy at the beginning and he was always like a little lover boy like he used to always touch my hair well, you met them when they were young too though yeah and he was five and he was i think just turned nine. What do you say in English like un chimoso? He was nosy. He was nosy well, from he the beginning. He still is. <laughs> what is it? He's always in people's. He's always. Chimney. So he was always from the beginning. I remember he said something like, I know you slept in our house before because I smelled you in my dad's sheets. I'm like, oh my god. <laughs> that scared me. I'm not even gonna lie. Our relationship has grown so much where it's, it's it's so beautiful. So if you're a stepmom or you're a new stepmom or you're a stepmom that's been a stepmom for a while and you don't have a good relationship with the kids. I think it's like be really genuine with them because they can feel when you're being fake. They can feel when you're not being genuine with them. Really treat them as if like they were your own. Don't think with like malicious thoughts of like, oh, but that's not my child or oh, that was from Like, don't think like that. Think of like, you know, this is a beautiful human being that I'm gonna grow with and a few years from now, he's gonna be like, wow, look, this is my stepmom and my stepmom is dope. And he could go back to his mom and be like, mom, I had such a great time with my dad and my stepmom. And I think that's such a beautiful thing. I wanna expand on that really quick because okay. it's not as, it's not as beautiful as Kai's painting this in every relationship, okay, yeah. right? Because the grown-ups have a lot to do with this. Like I have a very, very healthy relationship with the mother of both of my children. And we have very like good open communication. Eddie's mom is married, you know, and I get along with his stepdad. That's my son's stepdad. I never thought I would be saying that, but I get very along with him. Mm -hmm. Whether my flaws, his flaws, right? We are bonded by the kids. Same goes with De Niro's mom, right? She's she has a boyfriend and she's planning to bring him around. And I respect it enough to trust her to know who she's gonna bring around my son, vice versa. You know, so she has a very good relationship with Kat. That has a lot to do with how the relationship of kid and stepmom, kid and stepdad has to do with. You know, it's not just, you well, know, the I, kids are great kids. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's no, a beautiful thing. Guys. We we just made that happen, yeah. right? So if you are a step parent um, looking at this video, right. make sure you play well, your part. I was speaking based on how is it like to be a stepmom with the kids. Now, co-parenting, that's a whole different segment that we can go more in depth of. The standards have to be, you know, put between all the grown-ups first before you can even have that relationship with the kids and now it can be a healthy relationship. And for all the guys watching who are like, oh, how does, you know, Eddie get his, his fiance and both of the mothers of his kid all in the same room, you gotta stop thinking like a bitch. I'll tell you straight, like if you're playing with any of their emotions and putting people in the room, talking and feeling like you some type of player or some shit, you fucking up already and you are, you are doing this at the cost of your kid's future. I'm definitely not gonna take all the credit here, but I play a big part in making all this happen, right? Because I know a lot of step parents, I know a lot of people who are around, you know, my parents being an example that didn't do that so well, 
20 years later, still a fucking mess. That's a good answer, right? If you guys mm -hmm. want any more details or if you want us to segue into another maybe area of that question. Yeah, I think that that topic, comments. it can go so many different ways. If you want to know more about that topic in general and you want us to go a little bit more specific, just let us know in the comments. But Get make sure you guys it. are dropping some more questions in the book.